Hello, hello, testing sound, testing sound, checking, checking. Checking sound, testing sound, anybody there, anybody there? Not yet, okay. Ramelos, how are you? Hi, teacher. Hey, that's Thank you. good to hear, great. Great. Nice. Good. What about you? I'm doing fine. Okay. It's doing all right. It's it's very hot today, isn't it? Yeah, really. A very, very yeah. hot day. That's why. Where do, where do you live? In Mexicanos. All right. Okay. Yeah. And how about you? In Santa Tecla. Okay. Not, not that but, hot. It's yeah. hotter here. <laughs> Here. Yeah, it is really hot. Yeah, that's why you are wearing long sleeves. Yes, I, I recently I I arrived at home. Oh, so you just arrived uh, from work? Yeah, yeah. Okay, good, good. That's great. That's great. Let's wait for your classmates uh, to come. Okay. All right, here is Omar. Great, great, very good. Omar, how are you? Hello, teacher. I'm great. I'm great. Thank That's you so much. Great to Hello hear you, teacher. I'm all right. I'm all right. Doing fine. Claudia, welcome. I guess you can hear me yet. So, well, guys, uh, yesterday. Good Hello, good evening. So yesterday we we talked about uh, we talked about uh, I think it was uh subject verb agreement or oh, no it was the other it was product uh product testing vocabulary we talked about product testing vocabulary and uh different ways to test the product and so on so we will continue working with something similar today all right but uh we will begin with a short uh with a short kind of a game activity so what you're going to do is this. I will select one of you randomly and you have to uh, role play with your hands uh, an object like uh, make charades, like only with your hands you show an object. Like for example, I do this. What is it? What is it? Scissors. Scissors. All right, scissors, good. So you have to make your classmates guess what the objects you are making with your hands are. So you can use your hands to describe it, okay? Who wants to be first? And uh, please, just one thing, uh, let's, answer, let's answer quickly, all right? And the first answer will, will, be, uh, will be the winner, all right? So who wants to do it first? Okay, great. Romulo, go ahead. I, uh, my role is uh, show uh, the rest of my classmates and the problem, yeah. okay? Yeah, you do it here. You do the, the item with your hands, like ball or whatever, and uh, no words, no sounds, quiet, and we guess. All okay. right, go ahead, please. Okay. Glasses? Okay, yeah, Omar got it. All right, good. Very good, Omar. Great. Now, uh, let's see. It's my turn. All right, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. It's your turn. Okay. Headset. Yes. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> great. Very good. Let's ask uh, somebody else. Good job. Uh, Iris, do you want to try it? Uh, uh, driving? Driving. Mm, but it's an object, remember? It's not an action, it's an object. It's the thing, not the action. So, guess what? What is it? Right. All right. No. Claudia said it herself. It's a car. All right. Good. A car. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Great. I guess yeah. that's, that was it. Now, Claudia, it will be your, it's your turn. Ah, 
cream on your hands to put on the skin? No. Cream? One more time. Do no. it again. Repeat. Repeat. Mouse. Computer. Computer. Okay. Yes. Yes. Computer. <laughs> yeah, it was a computer. It was easy. Screen, mm -hmm. the mouse, and click. Yeah. Right? I got you. Very good. Very good. Well done. So that was just to warm up a little bit. Okay. I wish the others were here too. So, uh, well, so the idea of uh, today's class, and let's begin uh, begin sharing screen here. Uh, where were we? Over here. Uh, the idea of this class is to is to is to work on uh, conversations of product development, right? So we work, we are going to check on this. Just... One second, guys. It's... Well, it's really, really hot in here. So uh, the idea of the idea of today's class is this: is to establish the most appropriate method for testing a new product. Okay, great. So let's begin with these questions. All right, uh, Claudia, can you read the que uh, this question, please, and let me zoom for you to see it better. Okay. All right. Can you read it, please? Why do you think it is necessary to test products before they are released to the market? Okay. Have you ever tested a product? Great, good, very good. So let's discuss this and please give your opinions. Um, Omar, why do you think it's uh, necessary to test products before they are released to the market. Yeah, it's very important to see the product uh, and the first uh, tip. Uh, I think the uh, it's very important to uh, test the product because uh, only uh, you can to buy this product later. Okay, great. So uh, it's important to test it, all right? Okay. All right, good, good. So uh, now let's hear somebody else. Any other opinions on why we should uh, test the product? Why okay, uh, yes, Omar. Uh, oh, sorry. I think it's, uh, it's important because uh, a lot of the the owner or the pro or the or, or the factory mm -hmm. uh, detecting failure uh, before the 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 customer uh, uh, the customer check or 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 the customer. Uh, Detecting the, the failure uh, and and rejected the product after. Okay. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. I like that uh, that that point. So it's important because we can detect uh, failures or prevent. We we can prevent failures. And prevent. Okay. Yeah, uh -huh. and detect uh, flaws or weaknesses. Right. Okay. Flaws. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. flaws flaws uh, or weaknesses Detective right? flaws uh -huh. flaws all right flaws are like uh probably like mistakes mistake yeah yeah those are those are mistakes or or things that are probably not very good all right so and we if we detect flaws we also prevent failure all right we prevent Failure, all right? Okay. So, for example, if you hear 
about something that is not good at all, you hear the you know the best marketing sometimes is the word of, of mouth. Los como lo, los rumores o lo que transmite la gente, verdad? It, it's it's the is the greatest marketing. There are how many of you know a really really good pupusas uh, pupusas restaurant or place or or uh, a stand a pupusas food stand that doesn't have any but any marketing at all how many of you know one how many of you want say i in the chat if you do i i i just letter i i know one i know one no marketing what about you do you know any do you know any do you know any about any pupusas stand that doesn't have any marketing i do yeah all of them, uh, says Claudia, many of them don't have any marketing, but people say, hey, vam hey vamos a la señora de aquella de la esquina. Esa señora es una pupusa buena. And so the best marketing is the is word of mouth, right? So if people hear that uh, what you make is not good from others, they will not buy it. So we, if we test it first, we prevent failure and the and failure is not selling all right great so that's it and uh let's see let's ask uh have you ever tested a product probably at your work or probably you were part of an experiment or i don't know have you ever done that i i i haven't <laughs> i haven't sure <laughs> Uh, oh, no, I haven't. No, I haven't. Okay, uh, good, good. Let's see anybody, anybody who's uh, who's done it, tested a product. Have you ever tested a product? Mm, no, not yet, not yet. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's hear about it. What did you test, Iris? I tested a new machine for swim, swimming, swim stress. A sewing, a new sewing machine. Yeah, a new sewing machine. It's a new model, have a different and, and electric different parts. It's, it's new model. And okay. uh, um, salesperson. Uh, and we made the machine for two weeks, only for test. And, and need my opinion about the, um, the last nuevas funciones to try. About the new functions, yeah. Great. So you, you see, you did it yourself. So uh, <laughs> let's see, what type of testing do you think you you did in there? From what we saw yesterday, what type of testing was it? Use test. Yeah, good, very good. This is test. Uh, yeah, it was it was a use test, right? It was a use test because she had it there for two weeks. So she took it to her workplace and tested it for some time. And when she was happy with it, she kept it. All right. All right. Very good. Very good, like it. Thank you, guys. So uh, now, in this, the first part of this of this activity will be to check on this uh, short conversation, okay? And uh, here we will listen to. Wait, it's this guy. It's hey, there is some more vocabulary here. It's somewhere in here. All right. So we will uh, we will listen to this guy. All right. We'll listen to this guy uh, talking about a new a new product that will be released. Okay. So uh, we are going to we're going to 
see what happened here, all right, in this conversation. So let's read the situation. All right, what's the situation, uh, Mary? Please, can you tell us what's the situation? Uh, about the... Uh, yeah, this uh, conversation, please. Okay, I read. Mm -hmm. Yes, please. Oh, okay. Read the following conversation between Alejandro and his dad. Okay. They are making decision about testing the new papa's sandwich. All right. Good. Good. Okay. All right, and that's it. That's what that's what what they are discussing. They are taking decisions about testing a new sandwich. It's just a new sandwich, but we have to test it. It's important. So, uh, yeah, let's read it. Let's imagine uh, we have Alejandro here and uh, the father. So I guess, uh, Mario, you will take the, you will take Alejandro's row and uh, Romulo is going to be your father today. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Good. All right. Okay. Go ahead, please. Okay, we are ready to test our new product. What we, what do we do? First, I think the the side and the handle test will be the best option because it allows customer to see the product, feel it, smell, smell it, and taste it. it. And what all the other variable? Will the product be branded or not? I'll let you decide on that, son. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the monadic. Customers will eat and taste our product first, and then will rate it. I find it. I find it more coherent. Coherent. How can I pronounce? Uh, coherent. 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 Coherent, yes. Coherent for our new product, the Papa's Sandwich. You're learning, son. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc. All right. Very good. Very good. Thanks, Thank sir. you. All right. Good. So that's how you pronounce that word, coherent. Coherent. Yeah, that's that's the pronunciation in there. Okay, great. Great. So now uh, let's do this. We are going to work in, uh, in pairs. And uh, just in case you don't work with a man or work with a woman, uh, you, you you don't have to say son or daughter or father or whatever, you know, just adjust it to you, okay? Uh, and uh, please, 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 uh, let's, let's practice it together, all right? You take your roles, good. So let's work together here. And uh, I will send you a screenshot of it so you can see it on your phones. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, by the way, just a reminder to everyone, don't forget, don't forget to log in with your full name, okay? Okay. Yeah, that that is that is very very important that you that you log in with your full name, because uh, uh, Insaforp has to. Insaforp needs to know hundred percent sure that it's you, so they want your full name. All right. Good. So uh yeah now the the picture is on your is on your on your WhatsApp group, all right? So there we go. Now let's go ahead and uh, work in pairs.
All right, there we go. There might be a trio somewhere, so take turns if there is a trio. Okay, let's see. All right, there we go. All right, good. Let's wait for Jonathan to log in. Okay, good. Welcome, Jonathan. Uh, we are going to work in pairs, okay? So I will have you working with a classmate and uh, practice this conversation, all right? So the conversation is in your WhatsApp chat. Okay, here we go. Please accept the invitation. I'm here. You guys still haven't received it? Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. All right. Let's wait. Probably Zoom is taking longer. Okay. Okay, great. Everybody is in a group. Yeah. Uh, which role do 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 you do you want to to do? Huh? Excuse me. We have to continue. <laughs> okay. Uh. I, I, I am the son, yes, you, are, uh, you, you are my mother, That's okay? fine, because the last time you got in... Yeah. Okay. You, you yes, are my mom. Okay, it's fine. Yes. Okay. okay. <laughs> Great. Great. Very good. We are ready to test uh, our new product. What do we do? Character in the conversation. And only conversation, practice conversation. Yes, yes, only practice it. So you take your roles of a father or son. Yeah, and you can adjust it too. You can adjust it too. So like to a different, uh, different uh, type of food, for example. Use your creativity. Okay, great. Uh Okay, Mario. What about uh, what? What do you think? What product? What do you think? Mm, they say this Papa San. Hello, Arabella. Can you hear me? Yes, hello. How are well, you? I'm fine. What about you? Fine, thank you for asking. All right, great. So uh, we are working in pairs right now. Um, I, will, I will assign you to a pair and you listen to them. Okay, so you can listen to them and practice too. All right, okay, let me assign you to a group. Ah, very good, mm -hmm. thank you. All right, good. 
probably here to Maria's. Customer to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I'll let you decide it on that, uh, Jonathan. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the, moni the mon monadic. Customer will eat, will eat and taste our product first, and then will rate it. I find it more coherent for our new product, the Papa's Sandwich. You are learning, Jonathan. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc. Etc. I don't know how to use it. Sarah is a etc. Ah, etc. Yes, yeah. it's the same. It's almost the same. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Thank you. All right. Welcome. Good. I'll go check on the other group. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Sí, de la conversación, de los métodos. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, guys. How are you? Are uh, you finished? Yes. Yeah. Awesome. All right. Very good. Very good. So I guess uh, we will will go ahead and uh, and uh, check. On the, we need help with the pronunciation, teacher, please. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Uh, the variables. 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 Yeah, I will uh, spell it here. In the chat. All right, I'll put it in the chat. So that's uh, variables. Variables. Var the variables it sounds like this variables mm -hmm. can you see it in the chat Audience. yes i see the chat uh, okay and what's the other audience oh audience yeah that sounds like oh so it, it goes like this but you pronounce it like this oh you pronounce it like this. It's in the chat. Audience. Yeah, audience. Yeah, that's how it sounds like. E consumers or consumers? Consumers. 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 Yeah, consumers. I'll spell it here. Consumers. 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 All right, yeah, that's it. Consumers. Area. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, good, good. Thanks for asking questions. That's good. All right, I'll go check on another group before we go back. Yeah, exactly. Really. Yeah. It is. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Do you want to listen or do you want to read, Arabella? Um, <laughs> okay, I this moment I read the the message because I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, she's I'm just impressed. I just assigned her to the group so she listens to you. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Yeah, just We're, just to be part. But if you want to participate, that's perfect. But I assign you so you can, you know, see. And cat and what we're doing. All right, yeah, but you can participate too. Okay. It's up um, to you. It's whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you decide. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, we are ready to test our 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 new product. What do we do? Ah, yeah. Okay. Uh, Your role is uh, Alejandro, okay? And yes, yes. And Lilian is uh, a mother. Father. Uh -huh. okay. Very good. Okay. Go ahead, go ahead. Okay, okay. Ready, ready, Arabella? 
totality. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely. Let's go. Let's Absolutely. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> okay. We are ready to test our new product. What do you, what do we do? Okay. First, I think the sign and handling test will be, uh, will be best opinion because I, it always customers to see the product, feel it, smell it and test it. All right, good. Everybody is returning. Glad you guys are coming back. Very good. Very good. So I hope you guys are ready. Everybody will participate. We're just four small groups. So yes, everybody will be part of it. Okay, good. Good. So now, all right, here we got them all. So you guys, uh, now let's begin with the first group. Group number one is, uh, oops, it's Anna Lillian and Romulo. So uh, can you go ahead and, uh, and uh, do your okay. conversation, please? Okay. All right, go ahead, please. Okay. I'm going to be an Alejandro, okay? Yeah, okay. the sun. All right, the sun. Cool. Uh -huh. Go ahead, please. We are re ready to test a new product. What do we do? First, I think the site and handle test would be the best option because it is allowed the customer to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables will the product be branded or not i'll let you decide on that son great as for new method i was thinking about the mod monodic customers will eat and test our product first and then we'll are will rate it and find it more current for our new product, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning, daughter. We have so much work to do. We had to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype, our target audience, and marketing, marketing etc. Right, okay. Very good. Well done. Well done. All right, we've got here number two. That's uh, Mario and Omar. All right, please go ahead. Hey. I will be Alejandro. Am I going to be the father? Oh, great. Good. Go ahead, please. We are ready to test our products. What do we do? First, I think the side and holding test will be the best option because it's allowed the customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I will let you decide on that, so. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the monarchy Consumers will eat and taste our product first, and that will rate it. I feel I, I find it more co coherent for our new product. 
the chicken hamburger. You are learning some. We yeah. had so much work to do. We had to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype, our target audience, marketing, etc., etc. Okay. That's very it. good. Very good. Like it. Good. Good job, guys. Uh, let's see. So uh, now I think that their group was. Uh, yes, that's uh, Jonathan and Maria. All right, please go ahead. Okay. Um, I I will be Alejandro. All right. Good. Okay, we are ready to test our new product. What we do? What do we do? At first, I think the site and handling test would be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, smell it, and test it. What? What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I let you decide on that, Maria. Great. As for the method, I was thinking about the Monia customer. We'll eat and taste our product first, and then we'll rate it and find it more, more coherence for product, the Papa sandwich. You're learning, Maria. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about the potential customers, the prototype or target audience, marketing, etc. All right, good. Great job, great job, very good. Like it. All right, guys, uh, we are going to select another group. All right, the well, last one, that, that'll be Claudia and Iris. Please, girls, go ahead. I am Alejandro. Great. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? First, I, th I think the site and handling test will be the best option because it allows customers to see the product, feel it, and smell it, and taste it. What about the other variables? Will the product be branded or not? I'll let you decide on that, Iris. Great. As for the methods, I was thinking about the monadic consumers will eat and taste our product first, and they will rate it. it's more coherent for our new book, the Papa Sandwich. You're learning, Iris. We have so much work to do. We have to discuss about our potential customers, the prototype or target audience, marketing, etc. Great, great. Like it. Very good, girls. So, uh, yeah, that's it. All groups did their job. Now, uh, let's see. Uh, just a few observations, and it, and it's uh, in general, right? In general. Uh, well, here we have a first discuss, all right? We say this, discuss, like this, cuz, all right? Discuss, and the, that letter, that kind of O sound, it's very, it's very short, okay? Discuss, and the, uh, so it sounds like this, like this cuz, all right? And uh, also, let's see, oh yeah, say coherent, all right? Don't forget, I'll put it again, all right? The word coherent goes like this, coherent, all right? Coherent, and uh, also, Oh yeah, somebody asked about, about this one, about audience. Look, uh, the spelling is a little tricky. 
but you say this like this audience, all right, audience, or it sounds that the D sounds like an audience, all right, it's audience sounds. En plecas, entre plecas, les he puesto cómo se pronuncia, o sea, como una, un fonético así en español, ¿verdad? Cómo se pronuncian las, las palabras. Así que así es prácticamente como la dicen. Muy bien. Uh, yeah, and there was another. Yeah, somebody said a uh, variables too. Right? So. It goes like this. It goes like this. It sounds like this. All right. Good. So that's how it sounds like. Uh, was there any word that was uh, probably difficult to pronounce uh, to you? Did you find any other word that was probably difficult to say? For me, only very variables. Only uh -huh. variables. Variables. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so let, let's practice them, okay? Let's practice them all. So uh, let, we will take turns. Everybody will say them, right? And use, use, the, use the, the phonetic transcription I put in the chat. So let's read them. Uh, so first, uh, let's, ask, uh, let's ask Jonathan, can you read the words in the chat of my, oh, yeah. That will, that will be one, two. Monetic. Monetic. Mon monetic. Yeah, monetic. Monetic. Mm -hmm. Monetic. Yes, yeah, great, great, very good. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's pronounce them. So, uh, Jonathan, can you pronounce the, my, the words I put in the last uh, message? Okay, is discuss. Yes. Cogiden. No, it sounds like... Uh, like Coherent. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, audience. Mm -hmm. Yes. Variables. Yeah, variables. Right. Okay. Variables. See, uh, that, 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 that phonetic helps, helps a little bit. All right, good. Uh, let's ask uh, Maria, can you please? The microphone, microphone itself. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Mary. All right. I, okay. Let me see. <laughs> okay. Discuss. Coherent. Audience. Variables. And yeah. monadic. Yeah. All right. Good. Very good. Very good. Uh, let's hear the next one. Uh, I'll be, let me see somebody else. Uh, Mario, would you please? Okay. First, discuss. Coherent, audience, variables. All right, good. And uh, Anna Lillian, can you please? Again. Lily. Variables. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you break. In monadic. In. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Good. Let's ask. Uh, let's ask. Uh, Iris, can you please? Um, discuss. Coherent. Audience, variables, monadic. All right, good, good. All right, and uh, let's see, we're missing somebody else here. Probably Romulo, uh, can you say them all, please? The Discuss, mm -hmm. coherent, audience, variables, monadic. Okay, great, great, very good. Very good. Um, the, well, I, 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 does anybody else want to try? Oh, Beatrice, Beatrice, welcome again. Can you read the words in the chat, please? My last words in here. 
the ones we just practiced. The trees. Can't hear you. We may speak. Yes, now we can. Discuss, coherent, audience, variables. All right. Good, good. Say discuss one more time. Discuss. All right. Good. Coherent, audience. Variables, monadic. Mm -hmm. Great, great. It sounds good. Very good, guys. Uh, so uh, now we will move on and check on uh, some comprehension questions. All right, good. Uh, so now let's see about that. So here, look at this. Let me share my screen one more time. Ain't no thing. All right, good. So uh, at the end of this conversation, what type of test do they decide to apply? What type of test do they decide to apply at the end of the conversation? Monadic test. Monadic. Right. Monadic. Yeah, that'll be the monadic test. Okay, great. And uh, let's see. And how about for the Papa sandwich? Okay. All right, that will be, the, it's the same thing. I think it's the same question, isn't it? The Papa sandwich. Yeah, that will be the one. All right. Good. So let's forget about that one. All right. What are next decisions Alejandro and his dad? Uh, Let's have somebody read me this question, please. Uh, Iris, can you read question number three, please? What are the next decisions Alejandro and his dad will take about testing the new Papa Sandwich? Okay, so what are the new decisions they are making? They, they had to discuss, discuss about their uh, Potential customer, the prototype. No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, they have some work to do, so they have to discuss those things. Correct. They have to decide on the customers, a prototype, target audience, and that. All right. Is there any new vocabulary in here? Hay palabras nuevas. Do you can you can you see any new words in here? Can you see any new words in here? Any new vocabulary? Teacher, uh, yeah. only one. Mm -hmm. uh, monadic. I I don't understand two. Uh, okay. All right. And meaning. Now what's the meaning of it? Okay, a uh, monadic, a monadic test is a is a test in which you uh, you try things. Uh, you try only one item and rate it later. Okay, the word monadic it, it comes uh, is is a is a math related word. Es como una palabra de las matemáticas que dice mon, que se traduce en monádico. O sea que solamente que se refiere a uno, como mono, ¿verdad? Entonces, monadic, o sea que se utiliza un producto hasta el final y luego se prueba y se califica. Así como cuando se califica una película en Netflix que le da las cinco estrellas, ¿verdad? Y usted ahí lo califica. Uh -huh. Así es, de eso se trata, el monadic test. 
Okay. All right. Is, mm -hmm. is there any other? Is there any other? Is there any other? Uh, okay. All right. So, well, we will just uh, continue. So, you guys, uh, now uh, we will we'll go ahead and uh, listen to uh, a podcast. All right. Listen to a podcast about destination testing. Well, let's find out what this is about. All right. Let's just uh, listen to it for a general understanding, okay? Good, so let's get ready. All right, let's read first the prologue to this, please. Claudia, can you can you read what this podcast is about? In this podcast episode, user testing research manager Brian Kern and lead mobile researcher Lisa Pre Preville chat about destination testing and the capabilities of the new user testing mobile recorder. They discuss. And uh, all right, what do they discuss? What do they discuss? Uh, see, uh, what do they discuss? What's their, what's their name? What do they discuss, Mario? Uh, let's see. about the destination testing and uh, all right it's here the the three points the three points in here okay, okay. Uh, the difference between in the wild and destination testing mm -hmm. device versus beyond the device testing how users testing mobile recorded can be used to test real world usability. Okay, great. So they discuss the three points. All right, let's find out what it is about. Okay. I've been totally entrenched in this type of testing, so I'm happy to talk about it. Awesome. Um, so for some people who might not know, we just released an awesome new mobile recorder that um, you can now test things not in the lab and not in someone's home. Mm -hmm. So like we broke the, the surface with saying, hey, we're gonna get out of the lab. All right, let me play from the uh, beginning. Hi everybody, this is Brian Kern, research manager at User Testing. And today on the podcast, we're gonna talk about in the wild and destination testing with Lisa Preville. Hope you enjoy. How are you, Lisa? I'm really good. Thanks for awesome. having me here. Talk about destination testing, it's really cool. So yeah. it's something new that we're doing with our new mobile recorder. So. Yeah. I've been totally entrenched in this type of testing, so I'm happy to talk about it. Awesome. Um, so for some people who might not know, we just released an awesome new mobile recorder that um, you can now test things not in the lab and not in someone's home. Mm -hmm. So like we broke the, the surface with saying, hey, we're gonna get out of the lab and we're gonna go into people's homes and we're gonna show you people in their own home settings using their computers. So. We're taking it now a step further, which is awesome. Yeah, it's right? so cool. Yeah. Um, so like, what is it? Like, what is this next step that we're yeah. taking? Yeah, so the next step is that, you know, traditionally we had done mobile testing with a, you know, an IP book camera, a web camera at our testers' homes, kind of on their desk, wherever they set up their testing station, so to speak. But now we have this app that all our panelists, all our testers can download and they can actually record on the screen um, what they're doing on their mobile phones or on their mobile tablets too. So cool. Yeah. Okay, good. Let's stop there. So what type of app are they testing? What type of ad, app are they testing? To record, 
computer. A, a new record. A, a recording new... screen. Uh -huh. Okay, a new recorder. Yes. Uh, do you guys uh, do? You, can you guys use a screen recorder? Like, uh, or do you know about any app that has a screen recorder? I think you can do it on an iPhone, right? On an iPhone, you can record uh, your screen, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, on an iPhone you can, but an Android, that function is not automatically available. You have to use a separate app for that. No, no. right? The, in the Huawei, in my phone. Oh. This, this app, this uh, app is, Ya la trae. Uh, I think it's by default. It's by default. By default. Mm -hmm. by default. Okay. By default. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. I see. Well, not in my phone. Not in my phone. In my phone, I have to download a separate app. And uh, the bad thing about it is that it records the microphone. So, for example, I want to record, I want to screen record a video I'm watching, it will, it will record the audio from the video, but it will record the noise around me too. So it, it's okay. not very good. I try when, when you, I remember when with Instagram stories, I once uh, wanted to record one of my stories, but I couldn't because I recorded the audio and uh, the noise around me was there too. So I, I heard the dogs barking, ruff, ruff, and uh, everything around. So it was impossible. So that's what they're doing. They're testing a new screen recorder. Hey, when do you use a screen recorder, guys? Questions. When do you use a screen recorder? Anybody? Uh, I I use or uh, I use a screen recording when uh, I have a meeting and the topic is com difficult <laughs> and this this record I help me when 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 I have, I, I go into the document. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes. Good. That is a, that is a, a good, that is a good example. And it's a, a, a very practical, uh, yes. practical use. Very good. Thank you. Anybody else? Does anybody else use screen recording? Come on. Not only for work, like for for reg for any other activity uh, yes please uh, yeah, sometimes i use the screen recorder to explain uh, to my mom uh, use the some uh, app app, the app mm -hmm. or, or to open uh, or, or to show uh, uh, any option in the cell phone mm -hmm. Okay, so mm -hmm. you use it to help your mother. That's yes. that's mm -hmm. great. That's very good. Absolutely, and uh, yes, yes. Anybody else? Anybody else? And I use it. For, I don't use it for that, but it, it's a very practical thing to do, because sometimes uh, they forget, right? So they can play your video over and over and remember it. All right, hey guys, I have to run attendance. Hang on, stay there just a second. Let me run attendance before we continue. Okay, uh, remember, remember to respond present, okay? So here we go. Okay, great. So Jose, Jose Enrique de la O Salazar. No está. 
Ok. Supongo que la otra gente no la debo de mencionar. Ok, Rómulo. Presente, Romero. Ok, great. Present. Thank you. Claudia Evelyn Hernández. Present. Thank you. Iris Dorotea Sánchez Figueroa Acevedo. I'm here. Thank you. Marcela Belén Quintanilla Barquero. Marcela, no. Marie, Maria. Okay. Okay. Present. Okay. Sorry, I said Marcela. Jesus. Maria. Yes. <laughs> there, there was a Marcela here before. All right. Sorry. Omar Imer Gámez Linares. Present. Got you. Um, Ana Lilian González de Peraza. Present. Okay. Uh, Shane Deming Cabrera. It's not here. Mm, I'm worried about him. Great. Uh, Arabella Parada Gámez. I hear. Thank you. Mario Enrique Celaya. Mario Enrique Marquez Celaya. Present. Thank you. Uh, Gloria Beatriz Elias Alegría Oriana. Beatriz. Present teacher. Okay, all right, good, good. All right. Okay, good. And uh, let's see, next, uh, Elia Samuel Orellana. Elia Samuel Orellana. Mm, no está Elia Samuel. Okay, Adolfo Jonathan Rodriguez Parada. Present teacher. Got you, thank you. Aleida Elizabeth Juárez de Guevara. Oh, yeah. Ella está enferma. Me dijo que no podía venir. Ok. Andrea Elizabeth Sigüenza Mejía. Andrea. Andrea. Present, teacher. Yeah, yeah, I remember you were here. Me encontraba el micrófono. Oh, it's ok. Uh, Camila. Camila Calles Minero. No está. Sí, Camila no vino. Ok. So, yeah, we were talking uh, about the screen recorder. Yes. So, uh, yeah, we all use it. Uh, anybody else? Does anybody else use a, a screen recorder for anything else? No? No? No. No. Okay. Yeah, we don't really need it anymore because most things are in the cloud now, right? Everything is in the cloud, like uh, Instagram stories are in the cloud. So if you, you can also download them if you want to, unless you record somebody else's story, hashtag stalker. And uh, yeah, you don't really need it. You don't really need it. it it's it's pre pretty much not very important anymore. Okay, let's see how, let's listen to how these people test it, all right? Just uh, one second. So cool, because now you don't have to be at your... Just one second, let's uh, share the audio one more time. And also we have the transcript here, so you can read it. Desk. You don't have to be tethered to your computer. You can literally be on the couch taking a test. You can be out on the bus taking a test. And we're, we're talking a little bit about that today. And you can be pretty much anywhere. Mm -hmm. And you can test like where your users are just naturally using your product. Mm -hmm. But also you can tell them where to go if it's specific that you wanna see how they're using your product in context with their regular life. It's so cool. So let's actually, let's give a little context around this. So there's a big issue, right, in mobile testing, right? Like across in all of usability testing. Mm -hmm. um, but how do we, how do you get it in its natural environment, right? Yeah, totally. So a, like a desktop test or a laptop test, natural environment is easy to do. You sit them at the desk and they take a test, yeah, right? Yeah, it's pretty so, natural, yeah. yeah. Uh, whereas mobile, 
we, there's a whole bunch of issues, right? Like, how do you do it, right? Mm-hmm. Like, what is someone's natural environment with a mobile device? So can you give an example of a natural environment that someone might be in with a mobile device? Yeah, totally. A good example might be that I was at Target last week, and I was looking for a table, like a side table to put in my living room because it's pretty bare right now. And I saw this girl walk by me with her cart, and she had this side table that was so cool. And I was like, where is that side table? I need it immediately. Mm-hmm. But I didn't ask her because I hate like approaching people in stores. So I went and found it on my own, and it was just literally like a blank space in the shelf. Like she had taken the final, like the last <laughs> stock on the floor yeah. of this really, really cool table, and I was so mad. So I was like, okay, I don't like talking to store employees. I'm gonna do this myself. So yeah. I pulled out my phone. I, I found the table on the website, and then looked it up to see if it was in stock in my store. And the website told me that two were in stock. Mm-hmm. And I can only imagine at that point that those were the two that she had in her cart. <laughs> and I was like, no! Like, yeah. I tried to find this really cool table. Mm-hmm. I've been looking for, like, weeks. I didn't want to pay for, like, Ikea furniture. I just wanted to find something <laughs> easily after work. Yeah. And this girl had it in her cart. So I was mm-hmm. like, okay, well, let me see if I can, like, try and figure out if I can get another employee to, to help me. And so I got an employee to help me, which I hate doing, but I managed to do it. And he looked it up on his side, and then I looked it up on back order online. So I was using my phone in this context of being a target. It wouldn't have happened me tethered at my computer. You know, mm-hmm. I probably, for, if I was at home, I probably would have just done it online. I wouldn't have done it on my phone. But that's mm-hmm. kind of the magic of mobile is that you're not, you're doing things on mobile that you can't do at home. Yeah. So like shopping is a big thing yeah. that people don't necessarily shop online with a mobile device but they use it when they're in the store. Totally. Right? So I think that's yeah. like the, the, the kicker that like, um, there's a lot of space that you can test. Um, and that's where I guess this destination um, testing comes into play. So I know we're kicking around like in the wild destination. And so what is the difference? Yeah, totally. So we were kind of coming up with this methodology and we were throwing around this term that we heard from prospective clients called in the wild testing. And mm-hmm. like that is such a flashy, really cool name to describe what we're doing and it catches people's attention it's it's really neat it kind of invokes a more anthropological ethnographic mm-hmm. approach yeah. to testing um but what i discovered is i was kind of looking at a lot of sites that offer in the wild testing and what i realized is that what they mean by in the wild is actually outside the lab mm. so moving your usability research from a lab setting to an in the wild setting mm-hmm. outside of the lab obviously mm-hmm. and so when i was thinking about how to phrase or how to kind of define this methodology, that wasn't really appropriate because what user testing has done since the beginning of the company has been remote usability research mm-hmm. in the home, outside of the lab, right. anyway. Mm-hmm. So suddenly I was faced with this horrible conclusion that this really, really cool term doesn't actually mean what people think it means. <laughs> A lot of people think in the wild testing is more of this location-based destination testing and then it's out like, not really at home, but more- Okay, let's stop it here because it's too much. But uh, what it, what does in the wild? Yeah, and she speaks too fast. Oh, Jesus! But it's you know it's a good practice too because one thing it this it's okay that you watch or listen to people who speak like this because it's natural English. Okay, so once in a while it's okay to listen to things like this. So what type? Uh, what does in the wild, in the wild mean? What does in the wild testing mean? What does that mean? A natural environment. Okay, natural environment. Um, All right. the lab- laboratory. Not in the lab, right? Very good, very good. So let's type your ideas here. Not in the lab, uh, right? Not in the lab, and it's uh, natural use, uh, right? It's natural use. So uh, here, in this case, uh, what what kind of uh, what kind of products can you test like that, like in the wild or natural use? Mobile phones. Mobile phones, yeah. Mobile, all right, mobile phones and uh, any other thing that you can test like this. You know, I was thinking, I was thinking probably about uh, uh, about probably cars too. Cars should be tested this way 
because it's different when you take them to the to the wilderness you take them to the to the field so it's very different anything else that you can test like this anything else that you can test like this mm, probably well let's let's uh let's leave it like that so that that kind of material can be tested in that way all right very good very good there are also uh there are also some uh some tips to discuss about testing okay and we will check on that on those uh tips in a minute as well all right so we will learn about those uh 10 uh, those uh, tips for testing products. All right, good. Good, just a second guys. All right, good. So we're, we're gonna read about this and you, you guys uh, share your ideas. Let me share my screen. All right, very good. So look at this. All right, let's first uh, read the heading. Let me ask uh, Maria. Maria, can you read the, this, please? Okay. Our concept and product test measure reaction to a new product or service prior to development and, or launch. The information we got, got there through this test help our clients identify where to allocate product development and marketing research to generate the most growth. All right, good. So look, when do they do the testing? They do it look at this word prior do you understand this word prior do you understand that word prior well yes yes Clarita. yeah kind uh -huh. of kind of yeah you're kind of getting there getting the idea prior means before okay prior is the same as before so they test the product before they develop it before they manufacture it and before they uh, distribute it, okay? So that's what uh, prior means, uh, before. All right, so they do it before developing it, all right? So that's how it works, all right? So let's see what, what, their, what their testing is about, all right? Let's continue reading. Uh, Aries. Can you read uh, on the left, please? Can you read uh, what's on the left side, please? Iris, are you there? Um, main messages? Main messages that customers take away from a concept, including the functional and emotional benefits conveyed. Conveyed, okay. Conveyed. All right, good. We're gonna we're gonna jot down that word. All right, good. Uh, can you continue, please? Attitudes and beliefs. How valuable, memorable or interest, interesting the concept or product is. Mm -hmm. Great. And uh, or let's, case yes, intentions, continue. the likelihood of pushing, pushing the product or service, competitive preference, how cons consumers perceive the concept 
or products relate to com competitors better of works on price, quality, and other attributes. Attributes, okay. Attributes. All right. So uh, what this group does before they release uh, a product is, you know, checking on these four things. They check on the on uh, main messages, you know, the, the like like the high uh, the handling handling and site test, like the emotional messages that your product sends, and then also attitudes and beliefs, you know, how memorable your product or concept is, if it's catchy, así como que si es uh, interesante o si es eh, atractivo, and purchase intentions, like uh, the likelihood of purchasing the product, all right? And also, finally, how consumers perceive the product or relative, uh, relative to competitors, if it's better or worse. So what they do is a very good testing. And look, veamos, let's see, let's just uh, see very quickly to whom this has worked the, boat, uh, the most, okay? Uh, please, please, uh, let's ask, let's ask uh, Maria to read uh, the right, please. Who, me? Yes, yes, please, Maria. Okay. We have implemented numerous concept and product tests to help client study issues such as the following. Mm -hmm. Concept for the menu of a seafood restaurant chain. Yes. Future of a insert product under consideration. A new financial service under development. Frozen food product under development. A new food item under consideration for sale to food service operation. Op op opera operators. Uh, operators. Operator. Mm -hmm. Retail format and early stage rollout. Roll rollout. Yeah, rollout. Okay, good. So look how many types of businesses they have, uh, they have tested, all right? So uh, those are those are all the all the types of uh, all the types of uh, people they have uh, they have uh, help studying all the types of products they have helped studying. All right, so they they take care of this like concepts for the menu of a seafood restaurant chain. Th those are good points. Guys, uh, we're about to work on. We're about to work on a, on a on a short conversation, very similar to the one you just did. Okay, vamos a hacer una conversación muy similar a la que ustedes eh, a la que ustedes eh, simularon en la en la primera actividad. Okay, but this time. And this time, you are going to uh, you're going to uh, make up everything, okay, to your own creativity. So probably it's not gonna be a restaurant. No va a ser sobre un restaurante. It will. It can be about something else, or it, it can be about uh, probably a pizza restaurant, or it can be. Uh, a different, um, a different, uh, what? Say a different uh, lotion or anything like that. So you have to think about your and your company. Okay, you have to think about your company and about a new product that you want to release, but you have to test before. Okay, so. Please uh, let's use let's use the the 
the same image from page, uh, that's on page one more time. That's on uh, page uh, 20, if I'm not mistaken. Use the same, uh, the same uh, model from page 20. Of course, you modified it. You, you can modify it. So use this model and uh, then you guys uh, share you guys share your ideas, okay, with us. You, you share your conversation. So we will adjust this conversation, the one from page number 20, all right? So is it clear? Is it clear so far? Is it? Is it? Is it? Yes. Yes. Yeah? Okay, good. So first we go, we work in groups for uh, one or two minutes. So you can, so you can decide on, a, so you can decide on a, on a product and a company, right? And after you do that, we go back, you tell me what your company is and so on. And then we work on our role play. All right. So let's, work first on uh, on deciding our product all right we're gonna create them again okay five groups that's good all right let's work together Please uh, accept the invitation. All right. Give me a second. Voy a volver a hacerlos porque pasó algo como que se desbalanceó el número. I'm going to do it again. Just let's wait for your classmates. They they will come back. Zoom. Teacher. Yes. No estoy en ningún grupo. Ajá, sí, por eso. Es que lo que pasa es que ahorita los mandé de regreso porque se habían como desbalanceado, como que habían más en uno que otro. Mm. Ya, yeah, so I will create them again. Los voy a volver a hacer. Porque lo que pasó es que como que alguien, alguien okay. salió y volvió a entrar, entonces me desbalanceó el número. But don't worry, it's all taken care of. Oopsie. Well, anyways, there are going to be trios. Okay, vamos a tener que trabajar en, en trios. Porque como que hay alguien que se salió. So, all right, good. So if you're in a trio, I think there are, yeah. yes? Yeah, who called me? Alguien me llamó? Nope. Okay. So again, I recreated the groups. There is one trio. So in your trio, you, you decide on how to do the conversation, all right? Make sure everybody, make sure everybody participates. Okay, ahora sí, okay? Here we go. Anna Lillian is the one. Hmm. Yes, Anna Lillian. I have problems with the internet. I have problems and sometimes I don't know because I see. I think it is very slowly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's sometimes too slow. And sometimes you know that the screen is like a freeze. Yeah, it freezes. I don't know why I think internet uh-huh yeah and are you problem. on your phone or on your computer 
Where? Oh, um, I am in computer because I think in the computer because yeah. now, I, but it's slowly too. Okay, so it's not the, it's not the, the device, so it's the internet then. It's the internet at home because I'm connected but Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. What if you get closer to you to the uh -huh. router? Why? I... Why don't you get closer to your router? Como que se que se siente un poquito más cerquita del 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 router. Right, but, but my my daughter. Uh huh. I try to because but my daughter is in classes too. Maybe that's why. Oh uh, yeah. That must be the reason. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And it's in in a uh, Zoom too. Okay. Yeah. All right. Good. Hey guys, why why are you back here? ¿Qué les pasó? ¿Por qué están de regreso? I don't have uh, partners in my group. I don't have partners too. <laughs> oh man, what do we do here? Okay, vamos a hacer esto. Mm -hmm. Why, why? Pero ustedes estaban en un solo grupo. Quiero ver, era Arabella. Tendría que haber ido, ido a ese grupo. ¿Qué le pasó a Arabella? No, no vi la alerta. Ahorita sí ya lo veo. Ok. Me, me, me voy. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Romulo, can you access to that alert again? No. And, nope. No. Mm, ok. Los vamos a, vamos a hacer. Mario está ahí todavía. Arabella se fue, mira. <ríe> ok. Ah, vaya, lo que voy a hacer, Rómulo, es que lo voy a, lo voy a re... Así. Quiero decir, voy a mover, a, lo voy a mover al grupo de Mario, creo que es donde está solo uno. Ok. Bien, lo moví al grupo de Mario para que trabaje con él. I, I, I... Did you receive the alert? No. Oh man, what happens in here? ¿Qué sucede? Okay. Mm. Mario is here too. Yeah, Mario is here too. So it doesn't uh, work. I, I see uh, in the actions we had one, two. Actions, right? And you can join. Uh, all right. Yeah. When okay. See participants. Uh, Share your screen so we can see what what you're talking about, and everybody can join a group. Yeah, I will go. Okay. Share your screen and and show us, please. I doesn't have an invitation. Uh, you don't have an invitation. No, all right. Me too. Okay, let no, me see. I will send you to group number four where, uh, where. Okay, Ana Lilian, tendría que tener una para ah, group now, yes. cuatro. Okay, oh, and Romulo. Okay. You now, should... yes, Thank okay, you. great. Romulo, you should get one for, uh, Number five, but I don't receive really. Mm -hmm. Okay, the invitation. okay, give me one second. Lo voy a volver a, lo voy a volver a, a mandar. Tendría que ser el número. A lo mejor lo va a mandar un, ah, va, ahora sí, aquí. Vaya, ahora ya le tendría que recibir. Hice un switch ahí de uno a otro. No. No. It should be popping up. <laughs> okay. Right. Okay. Yeah. Great. Great. Very good.
There we go. Let's check on group number one. All right, good. Girls, uh, now have you decided on uh, on your product and company? Um, product, yes, but company we we have a choose a company or or a brand. Uh, a, a brand you can make it or it design. Ah. Yeah, you can create it. So it's it's up to you. It's your creativity. So you can think of probably it's a new pizza or you're working for Burger King as a as a pro, as product developers. So it's your creativity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So okay. Yeah, think about it. All right. Think about it. I'll check on the other groups. Okay. Yeah. All right. Here. Yeah. Okay. For example, uh, flavor. Uh -huh. uh, flavor. Smell. Uh, uh, the soda don't, doesn't smell, I think. <laughs> yeah. I color. Uh, maybe the, the color, puede ser el color, entonces. Si sí, es cierto, no traen. Uh -huh. <laughs> the flavor, colors. And I what means color, sabor. Ah, it's a little difficult to give the properties of the soda. The texture, probably. No, it's it's liquid, right? A texture. Mm -hmm. Yeah, texture yeah, if it's a very, very bubbly, feature. right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you can include that, right? Uh, yeah, the, our opinions are writing in the chat uh, uh, to con, con, uh, to make a good decision for okay. that, yeah, for good. our product, soda. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Great, and, uh, and it helps you keeping a record, right? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Yeah, great. All right, fine. I'll go check on the others. Get your shirt. Okay. You. Una pregunta me puede hacer. Mhm. Ya yo le cambié. Comenzamos con esa pregunta. Ah, dicho. Podemos decir, nosotros estamos emocionados por nuestro nuevo producto, por el lanzamiento de nuestro nuevo producto. ¿Qué hacemos? ¿Cómo lo hacemos? Ay, lo que está abajo que dice que si va a ser con marca o no. Ah, es que esa es la discusión que tienen ellos. Uh -huh. Si lo van, si han uh -huh. pensado en patentar su marca o no. Uh -huh. Puede ser una conversación copiar, así. Ese, como copiar las ideas de la compañía. ¿Qué marca le pondré? Pongámosle. Pero... Ginger drink. <laughs> natural natural drink. Okay. Bebidas naturales. Uh, yeah, green nature. Let's call it green ah. nature. Mm -hmm. Ah, green nature. Mm -hmm. Drink nature. nature. Mm -hmm. Drink. Yeah. Oh, drink. Oh, drink. I heard green. Okay, drink. Uh, drink. Porque uh, bebida natural, tichi. natural drinks. Okay, yeah, call it natural. Natural drink. Drinks. Yeah, natural drinks. Mm -hmm. All right, good. Good, very good. Teacher, now just, maybe just going to choose our product. Or, or make I a think conversation. Start working on the conversation because oh. uh, we had a problem with a group, and uh, and uh, I and I had to give them support. So we, I perdimos bastante tiempo con ellos. Entonces, no tuve el tiempo de sacarlos a todos y y y de ahí regresarlos. Entonces, con, comiencen a hacerlo de la conversación ya, porque sí tuvimos ese inconveniente. Mm -hmm. Yeah, start similar, working. Similar to the page 20. Yeah, exactly. Not the same, 
you know, it doesn't mm -hmm. have to be the same, but you adjust it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Great. Great. I'll go okay. check on the others. Thank you. All right. Okay. Well, yeah. Um How are you? How are you doing, girls? Uh, so we are uh, we are uh, uh, working in the structure. Okay. Where is right. our uh -huh. We are we are testing or we are going to to testing a new product. A new product is a coffee flavor blueberry. Oh, good. <laughs> a blueberry coffee. We awesome. are going to look for a, uh -huh, a blueberry coffee because it's something new ones. It's a different and it's uh, maybe some people's like and, and we are going to look for a customer for that product. All right. That sounds great. Good. 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 So, uh, <laughs> Crazy, don't... No? Yeah, no, I mean, a little bit crazy, but <laughs> yeah, but, but it's very creative. You know, you know, something to tell mm -hmm. the coffee is whatever you want, but the coffee is coffee. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That, that, that is true. You have to respect coffee. <laughs> yeah, good, good. I am test very, very different coffees, a different, you oh. know, the Juan Valdez, for example. I love it. Have flavors yeah this coffee yeah that's true mm -hmm. they have many different flavors i like it very much yeah. i i prefer i prefer one of this over starbucks yeah yeah it's very delicious yeah and it, you know why i think it's very relaxing too you yeah know. that's true um, yeah that's true <laughs> i don't know why but it's a, a very relaxing to me Mm. Yes. But it's coffee and I love it. All right, me too, me too. <laughs> yes, it is. For it is Arabella. I can mm. see Arabella. Arabella uh, there. But she should be here. Arabella? Hello. Hello. Okay, Hello. Yeah. yeah, she's here. Yeah, she's here. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. My computer is crazy now. <laughs> yeah, I imagine. Yes. The, my, uh, we broke his coffee. Um, I, this, this color, color is it's a blue. very difficult because <laughs> you know what the problem is now. The, the the color the, we coffee is color uh, blue then it's very blue <laughs> yes blue, yeah. the people uh, feel um, uh -huh. uh, curiosity <laughs> Very curious. Yeah, it's very curious. Curious. Yeah, cur uh, cur yeah. curious. Curious. And I think the people uh, want, uh, we want, and uh, uh, they want, they want to uh, taste the coffee because it's uh, strange. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes. 
18. All right, good. Yeah, of course, people will be, wow, you know, where is this coming from? Yeah, great. I'll go check on the other groups, all right? This is a better idea. Yeah, of course. <laughs> All right, I'll go check on um, Mario's. All right, Mario and Romulo. When I was in university, uh -huh. when I walk to take the bus, there are in the, in the, in the, in the center. Uh, which, which university are they? Uh, in the technology university. Huh? Tecnológica. Ah, tecnológica. Okay. okay. And when I walk to, to, to take the bus, I found a... A chalet? A chalet <laughs> that, that had a variety. Variety, variety yeah. Variety the, uh, to drink. So they have... Horchata de morro, horchata de coco, horchata, una rosada, no me acuerdo cuál es. Eh, cebada. Cebada. Ah, yes. oh, delicious. So, it's the best, I think, horchata ah, really? I taste. Okay, teacher, we have a Your set product. All ready, all ready to go. Okay, yeah. horchata de morro. <laughs> <laughs> really? Okay, I'll go check on the, on the, on the last group. All right, on it is in Berlin. Mm. All okay. right, That's, this is okay. most interesting. Girls, are you ready? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. You ready? Okay. Good. Good. So, uh, I'll go ahead and uh, I'll go ahead and. Uh, send everybody to the main group, all right? And then we share our conversations. Okay. Hello, is everybody back? Everybody coming back. All right, yeah, people are still coming. All right, good. Very good. I don't know where this girl bet Trace is at. Didn't, haven't heard anything about her. All right, great. Thank you guys. So let's begin. Uh, I have to run attendance first for the ones who were not here. So let's check in here. All right. Checking attendance again. Jose Enrique de la O Salazar. Ana Lilian Gonzalez de Peraza. Present teacher. Okay, yeah, okay, great. All right, so uh, Shane Sohar Deming Cabrera. Está. Okay, Gloria Beatriz Elias Alegría Orellana. Yeah, she was here. No. Okay, Elias Samuel Orellana Perez. Okay, Gloria Civino. This is a Marco. Bien, Aleida Elizabeth. Juárez de Guevara, no está, es enferma. Y Camila Caez Minero. Muy bien. Uh, okay. So we will continue working with the, with the conversation. So it's time to share. So guys, now please share your conversations with the class. All right. Let's do it. So uh, we will first have... All right, we'll first have uh, Mary and uh, Iris, okay? Please, Mary and Iris, go ahead. Okay. First. Okay, uh, Iris, we are ready to test our new product. What do we do? 
Um, um, we, we do uh, the monadic tests for new products. All right. Okay. And what do you think about a uh, customer? I think uh, we can found uh, new customers in um, malls or movies, maybe in a market, supermarket on a weekend for release the, the test. Okay, what what thing about the branch? The branch? Well, um, our branch is new, <laughs> but it's good. <laughs> I I hope <laughs> when the people testing um, may click with our branch. All right, all right, good, good. Very good. Is that it? Is that it? I know. Uh, it's a pizza. It's uh, her. Uh, his name is Happy Pizza. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Good. Good. All right. Good. All right, good, good, very good. So that's it, that's it about your product, right? So a new pizza and you're thinking about creating a new, a new branch, right? A new, and yeah. a new product for it. Like it, like it, very good. Very good, very good. Now uh, we will hear a new group or another group. So that'll be group number two two number two and uh, that's jonathan and omar so please guys share your conversation okay um, here we go uh, i begin i begin mm -hmm. uh, omar uh, what is the new product that we we will test uh, this is a new soda. We will launch it on the market. Okay, we will have to discuss our prices, potential customers, and we can see the deliveries in the restaurants and make a decision with the dealers and suppliers. It's true. Right. Okay, that's good. We can stand sales at point of sale, for example, supermarkets and stores, what else? Okay, excellent. Our customer uh, can drink it and to rate it. Mm -hmm. All right. That's okay. it, teacher. That's it. All right, thank you very much. Good job, guys. Okay, great. Now let's hear the other, the next group, okay? That will be, uh, let's see, checking on the next group. That's Andrea and Claudia. Please, girls, go ahead. Hi, Claudia. Hi. We are ready to test our new product. What do we do? I think the monadic method will be the best option because the customers drink the product they test and enjoying the flavor natural of ginger. Will the product be branded or not? Yes, we do the brand name. Will be natural drinks. I agree, the number brandy. Right. Is that it? We have to discuss about the logo, imaging, and color. Okay. All right. Good. Good. 
Thank you. All right, don't forget, we say name. We refer to name, all right? Name of the, of the, of the product, all right, that's okay. That's good, very good. But it was a very creative idea too. Hey, now uh, let's see, I also have Arabel. oh, this girl is gone, hang on. Anna Lillian, oh gee, she's gone. Okay, never mind. Oh yeah, Anna Lillian is back. Let's have a, let's have Anna Lillian, oh, she's gone again. So never mind. let's have Romulo and Mario. And let's wait for Arabella and Anna Lillian to log in. All right, go ahead, please. Okay, well. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, please. Uh, our new product is, uh, well, our product is about for chat tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Romulo, we are ready to test our new product. What do we do? Uh, almost ready because uh, we need to first uh, handling and handling tests inside the product because uh, it's important the customer uh, tested it, tested, tested it and smell the, the new product. All right, and what about the other things, the other new variable? Will the product uh, be run it or not? If you learned, uh, you can you can decide. Oh, great! Okay. Um, I think the monadic method is going to be very well to the customers drink and taste our product first, and then we we'll rate it. I find it more coherent for the product for our company. Okay, uh, we had to discuss uh, about the, uh, the customers and uh, the prototype and uh, target, target audience and marketing, marketing too. Right. Okay, let's do it. Okay, great. Thank you. <laughs> Very good. Well done, guys. Like it. Hey, uh, then uh, last group, okay? El último. Last group, uh, Arabella and Ana Lilian. Can you please? Teacher. Yes? We, we doesn't finish the structure, the conversation, but we testing a new product it is a blueberry coffee okay oh yeah but uh, uh -huh. again you the, the are you still having this problem that you are logged in and logged out from the meeting are you still having your that problem that you're yes logged we have a problem in the Medium teacher, that's why we can. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, no, all right, never mind. So, if you couldn't, if you couldn't uh, finish it, I think uh, we will, uh, we will, you know, we will stop the, the participations here. But uh, we will now go ahead and uh, we'll go ahead and uh, just check on uh, some uh, feedback okay for your conversations so uh now first uh let's practice some words like uh for example image all right we have the word image image okay when we that's when we talk about the the presentation of the product okay image so don't forget it goes like image Suena muy parecido el, el sonido a, a la A, 
por ejemplo, es como el sonido de la palabra ya. Nosotros decimos ya, ¿verdad? Entonces, el sonido final es como esto, algo así. Se los voy a poner acá. Image. Algo así suena, como image. Ok, image. All right, and uh, also, what about, what about, there was another, oh, suppliers, okay, suppliers. The word suppliers is here too. That's how you actually pronounce it, suppliers. All right, then uh, we also, we also have uh, another word like, uh, for example, word, uh, texture, okay, texture, all right, good, uh, so far in the, the conversations, was there any new vocabulary, was there any new word that you saw in the conversations we did today, any new vocabulary you saw, for example, here, in this one, no habían palabras nuevas, nope, No, all good here? Is it all good? Well, all good. Nope. all right, yeah, great, great. Nope, not a problem, guys. Hey, just a, a quick announcement to everybody. Uh, please uh, don't forget to log in with your full name, all right? That's very important. That's very important to, to log in with your full name because as you can see here, or, or here in my list, you are with your full name. So Insafwerp is very picky and, and it's very strict. So they check that the person logged in in the meeting and marked in the attendance is the exact same person, tiene que ser, o sea, exacto, exacto, todos los datos tienen que cuadrar perfectamente, ellos auditan todo, todo, todo esto, o sea, cabeza por cabeza y, y tiene que pegar cabal, así que, yeah, so for tomorrow, please don't forget to log in with your full name, all right, it's very important that you do that, And also, uh, don't forget to do your homework. I think it should be ready. También ya puse las discusiones, okay? Las de esta semana. Para que las comencemos a responder. Y si no, pues comenzamos. Mañana vamos a tomarnos un tiempo para responder ahí en las discusiones, okay? So get ready for it, all right? Thank you very much, everybody. Hope you have a wonderful night. And I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. Good night. Goodbye.